Right, I'm just going to show you how to rig up the big soft foreplay here on a very light jig head. This is a 12 and a half gram ball jig head. I've put on a small treble hook stinger like so. I'm just going to put that on here. What I'm going to do, I'm not going to put it totally straight through. I'm just going to give the body just a little curve so I get this fantastic action in the water. So, and then I'm just going to give it a little drop of super glue just before I put it all the way up. Just going to super glue that a little bit like that. And then we are ready to go. So, it has a little bit of curve to it. I've got the stinger lined like so. I'm going to put the stinger here on the side like that. And then we're ready to go. I'm just going to have get a little uh, lip skull ready here. So it's the foreplay lip skull. So I have the crankbait version of a 19 centimeter foreplay. Just remove that little pin. Put in the soft lure. And then I can put the pin back through the gill. And we're ready to rock. Comes out beautiful like that. Soft four play in the lip skull. Okay, let's go get a fish. Oh, there we go. Oh, it didn't take long. Wow. Soft four play right there. Soft ball play. I know where the big one lives. And I'm gonna serve him a snack. Oy. Nice follow, nice follow. There we go. They're always just gonna pop on a baby side here and leave the big one in the water. And then I'm just gonna go in that direction in there. There we go. Oh, keep right charging at it. Gotta put this one out of the water. There we go. Oh, did he have it or what? Look at that. Oh. Yeah! Soft for play. Beautiful attack right there. Then I'm going to show you how to hook the soft for play with this white gate offset hook. So I open first the slot in the belly. I pass the hook straight through so it comes right out the back like that. And I take that up into the nose and up through there. So the hook is basically hidden like so inside. That's the way to fish it. in front of the boat he took it. Okay, now we're gonna go out and do some trolling. We're going to search the big basang here of the lake to see if we can find the pike, and we're going to use natural baits in the foreplay lip skulls. The first one, I'm simply just gonna take, this is a herring, I'm just gonna pass that into the lip skull and put the pin straight through. As you can see, the pin comes in right behind the gill plate, so that holds it good in position here. Then, for this one, I've just added an extra swivel here between the two spin rings just to give that one a little more balance. So we're going to troll this one next to a, a soft foreplay. Soft foreplay, as you see, comes in very easy into the lip skull. I'm going to do a little trick here. I'm going to use a piece of 
meat just to give a little extra attraction before I load the soft foreplay. So I'm just gonna cut a slice of meat like that. I'm gonna load that into the head so I got that great uh, smell here of uh, dead bait. And then I'm going to put the soft foreplay in after. So that will just give you that scent. There we go, come straight through. So that is a scented soft foreplay right there. Let's see how that works. I'm just gonna find the right troll speed here. If you have a look at that lure, see how erratic that swims. See that right there is just gonna do the trick. With this one I'm just gonna put out about 20 meters. I'm gonna lock this rod in position. So, so this is actually a, a real herring I put into that lip skull if you have a look at that action. Fish on, fish on. Ah, oh, lost it. That was a fish on right there. Damn. That's a fish on. Oh, bite again. He's taking it. Come on. Had several bites. Oh, yep. There we go. He was following that. Oh, good. So that was the soft foreplay and the lips go with the sander. Just loaded that with a little strip of herring and it just got hammered down there. Look at that. There we go. Wow. So, oh, oh, what a shame. We lost him. That's fishing. So we got the soft foreplay here loaded up with that little piece of herring meat in there. Superb. Let's try again. Shoot, shoot. Oi. Yep, there we go. Oh. That was a good bite. Oh, that is a nice fish, I think. See that back there? Yep. So I just couldn't resist that soft foreplay there. So the soft foreplay is out fishing the real herring right now and the lip skull. What we have done, oh I think this one has got an eel coming out the mouth. Let's have a look at that, that's a very interesting phenomenon here. See that? Something is coming out of the mouth of that fish. See on the side? He's got an eel coming out. He's had a very big eel there, you can see. It's coming an eel out of the mouth there. Could condition that fish. Got it. Oh, what a fat fish. Yeah. Ha <laughs> ha. Nice one. Oh. <laughs> there you go. That was about 10 minutes of trolling right on the soft floor play. Bam. Well, this venue holds a lot of eels, and it's very obvious that this one had a big eel for supper some days ago. Let's just measure up. That one just goes 99 centimeters right there. All right, let's put her back. I'm just gonna hold her for a second here. And there we go. Oh! <laughs> Good one! 